Taj Palace Kolaba I am sure the name sends most of us into nostalgic memories of the structure Many of us have been into the structure I have been fortunate to be associated with the conservation of the structure after the 26/11 2008 terrorist attack I would share my experiences about the conservation in some other video Today I want to share with you how we conserved a particular component of the structure that is balconies Taj balconies were created as stand alone units as a part of aesthetics and limited utility to enhance the usage during monsoon and fair weather the balconies were enclosed somewhere during the service life of the structure for now the balconies had an unfortunate collapse the task of restoration of the collapsed portion of the structure was taken up instantly the first step was to make as existing or as built drawings of the collapsed portion the cross section depicts four layers of stone on which the balcony rests cantilevering out in a corbelling effect the construction drawings were thus prepared by reverse engineering and structural connections were developed for the collapsed portion several techniques of recreating the balcony were thought of and cross sectional concept drawings were prepared none of the drawings were found good enough because we were worried about the history and the integrity of the structure if we changed the material of construction from the original so after a debate it was decided that we would use all the collapsed stones mind you the stones were weighing up to 750 kilos and recreate the balcony using the same stones was it possible completely collapsed stones which which had fallen from a height of 20 feet 30 feet disfigured ornamental features uh, dislodged stones broken in two or three fragments but the challenge was taken luckily we had a very good contractor who also willingly accepted the challenge of restoring the balcony using the collapsed stones all the stones were identified and assembled at the ground level the stones were taken to their original location piece by piece and re-erected using stainless steel pins extra long drills were created and through holes were made into stone so that the entire stone can be fixed back to the original structure using extra long stainless steel pins the entire structural connections were ensured using ss316 marine grade stainless steel and epoxy the annular space between the stainless steel pins and the drilled holes were grouted effectively using epoxy grout all the damaged ornamental features because of the collapse from a greater height were restored using lime mortar and the entire balcony was painted back to its original glory
now the question also remained that was it only one of the balconies which was damaged or there were more number of balconies which had a similar damage so an exhaustive survey was carried out the balconies which had developed cracks were identified and a preventive restoration job was taken up for restoring the already cracked balconies to make the structure safe and to avoid any mishap this project though small in its magnitude was extremely intricate and i was happy that we could achieve it successfully with the support from the clients and the contractor Thank mm -hmm. you.